uh, we're going to go over on the other side of that house through the woods and try to knock out a little old job pretty quick it's not anything major I'm just going to need the mini uh possibly the pole saw and chainsaw get some stuff down and really no cleanup just other than just setting the stuff off the hill that's all they want but the biggest part of this thing is just going to get my work my way back around there so we're going to see how this goes to make it happen so the house is up there it's the brick structure up there and then they got like a garage shed right there and then over the knob right there the hill there is a swimming pool in the pool house right there that uh i've been on down this road a bunch of times i never realized there was a swimming pool right there matter of fact i have worked down there in the woods and i still didn't realize that there was a swimming pool there until they uh we were walking around looking at some of their stuff on the property there and seeing the swimming pool but uh i have done work on this road for just almost everybody that lives on this road here and we're gonna go back there and see if we can get it done here a little foam was laying right there and it jumped up took off down here and it's hung in the wire down here oh, okay maybe it's going there it goes see it right there i was finna go down there and get it out a little spotted foam it's not very old so the mama's gonna be somewhere around here and you just leave them alone mama they'll get back together but uh like i said it was laying right there in that warm spot I was going to get it out of that. There's an old hog wire fence down through there. I was going to get it untangled out of it so it didn't get hurt or anything. But thankfully, it got on out and I had to put it in there and touch it.
this was the bad one right here. This one actually went up and made a complete U and went over that uh, old well house right there. It's a poplar too, and they their their fibers are not real good and they're real easy to snap. I figured it would snap when I was pulling on it to bring it back. So what I've done is I brought it back and over to the right. Now I'm gonna ease through it with a with the pole saw. It's probably gonna pop on me, imagine, but if it does, it's all right with it going back out of way. You can see it, I've got it all the way over there now. It was growing out over the well house. So I'm gonna get get this one down and then I'm gonna get this one right here get it too it's got a bad muscadine vine in it there's also a water line that's gonna be coming right down through here so I'm gonna, it runs right down the fence there look the way it does so. Snatch that thing up here. Get off my pole so freed up just a little bit. But they're holding us all. I didn't have that fence there, it'd been screwed on that pole saw, so would have I'm not sure what I would have done, but that's the only bad thing about using pole saw so you get hung like it. I was hoping though I could do it like that other one you watched up there where it just kind of rolled, gently rolled off the sump. like this are a little tedious but you know just work them in and do them get them done they pay good
looks a lot better. Got that opened up because uh, what's happening was that poplar was bowed over it and then the muscadine vines was going up them other trees there. And it had that thing weighted so bad over that whale house. And so now all that's gone. And was able to get up in there get it done and keep the integrity of the hill all the debris and everything on it so now when it rains it won't start eroding or washing uh, any of that stuff off so looks nice uh, they should be happy with it and i'm about to pack up track all the way out here i gotta go all the way back around the uh pool house back out to the road out there wasn't as bad as i thought it was gonna be working my way up around through here this is a uh, some tough terrain in this area very steep hills and just gorges that go down in where the water runs off so you got hey i sitting on a knob uh deep hole right here and then there's another house over there and each each ridge top there's a house sitting on top of it but i'm grabbing a saw up and we're gonna head on to the next one